Hello everybody, how's it going? It's Eamon here, back again with some more OMSI 2 for you guys. And today we are just going to be looking at the new um, Payware DLC from uh, Halicon Media. And it's the new DLC called OMSI 2 Add-on Berlin BRT, which base stands for the Berlin Rapid Transit. Um, the Bus Rapid Transit. Um, this is a new DLC that has just come out from Halicon this morning, um, the 24th of the 8th, 2020. And it basically what it is, is... Berlin X10 except in 2019 slash 2020 um, yeah uh, that's pretty much the gist of it basically what they have done is they've reproduced um, a reproduction of the the rapid transit line X10 from the end of 2019 including the sidelines of what you would have got with the Berlin X10 in 2015 now I must point out that um, this is a standalone add-on so you do not need to have Berlin X10 to play this. So this is basically, it's a new map, um, but you do not need Berlin X10 to play this. So if you don't have Berlin X10, which is highly unlikely because I think everybody has Berlin X10 at this stage, um, you can still buy this and play this. Um, but if you're thinking of buying Berlin X10 and this, so I would probably, I don't know for sure because I've just loaded this in, so I don't know how it performs graphic wise and how it, um, how much better our difference it is to the 2015 Berlin X10. So we're going to have a look today at the Route X10 in this new, um, the BRT, and see what's changed really from the original five years ago. Um, they've optimized the traffic engineering through, um, there's new roads and stuff like that, um, there's new line management the sounds and um, you get a man dl05 and a c2 solo e6 bus so there's um two buses with the add-on there's a dl05 and there's a c6 solo it's around there somewhere i've seen it um, floating around so what we're going to do is just drive the route x10 and see what's different um in the add-on compared to what happened in 2015 and see how because you know me i have done a lot of videos on Berlin X10. I think I lived in Berlin at one stage in OMSI. Um, I just kept driving and driving and driving and driving it because I think with Bus Company Simulator you get the the most money for the longest routes. So I think I was doing um, Berlin X10 a lot. So I was. So we go down to pick our route. We're going to go from Herzilla to Rambrook, I think it is. If I can find it, there it is. Whoa, we don't start at 2 o'clock. So I'm looking at the timetable now. I'll show you now when we go in. Um, I'm just going to do the time, just to boost it up a bit. So, whoa, whoa! What's this? A race? Calm down, air buses. So let's go into our bus. We should have a timetable up there. So I think in the previous game, the in the 2015 Berlin X10, I think the X10 was maybe 50 minutes or so. So, if you're looking at this, it's cut a bit off it. Not much though. Um, not a lot. Considering it looks like it's the same amount of stops as well. I'm not sure though. Right, so let's just start up our bus and get ready to go. What time are we going at? I don't even know. Um, you can see that this bus is supplied with a new ticket machine. Uh, I don't know how to use it just yet. It doesn't look like it's working. Um, the fonts are missing, so uh, that's good. Uh, what's this? Oh, that's gone. Um, I think the fonts are missing on the ticket machine, so we can't really do much about that. Let's just go to X10. I think there will be an update because... Um, the usually is updates. This is like the f it's literally been released an hour, so um, I need to find my destination. I kind of want to keep this video quick because it's a long route. Tento, there we go. So let's see. X10 fonts aren't missing, so maybe the fonts for the ticket machine are missing. I don't know. I guess I'm doing something wrong. There's also no manual as well, um, I must say that um, this morning. There's no actual manual with the bus, uh, with the add-on, for some reason. I don't know why, um, it just says that there is, it doesn't say anything, there's no manual. It has like a manual document, but you can't open it because it just says it's a file, so I don't know. So I'm going at what time? 13.59, so 2 o'clock, so 
57, let's say. Ah, uh, freaking 57. I thought the other bus would come in, but sure look, it didn't. So we're probably going over there. Um, that's a new bus stop over here. Um, this wasn't here in the last add-on. Either was that. So this is new. Um, I think we stop at it. X10, yeah, Ram Brookie. So um, we might move over there now anyway. I wonder if the bus will beep like it did the last time. 57, 58. I'll go up there, we'll see, let's see. Will you? Where's he going? Beep. Beep. Oh, see, there's a time, 1359, so it didn't beep. Which is a bit of a shame. Because the last one, the old DL used to be, which was good. Yeah. I don't know what the A is for. Um, again, no manual, so I don't know. So, I'm guessing that the people don't talk either with the sounds of it. She didn't say anything. So I have traffic lights here, which is good. I like that. Um, they weren't there before. It says there's a comprehensive PDF manual over 50 pages, but I can't find it anywhere. So if anyone knows where it is, well, probably by the time this video comes out, it will probably be updated. Um, it's not in my add-ons folder, so... Maybe they were late to get the manual out to us. There's the C2 bear now. We'll check it out in another video. We set up that lag there where the, the buildings kind of take a while to come into frame when they turn that corner. So this is all changed here as you can see. We kind of have it kind of, um, we kind of get out of the way, you know, we can pull into the, the bus stops rather than kind of having a straight bumpy road. So a lot has happened in five years in Berlin, I think. Face mask mandatory. Go for girdles. And blades. Hello. Oh, I'm not wrong. Sure she was reading here party. saying that 2013 of the, the status of Berlin is the next 10. 2013, not 2015. But it was released in 2015, I'm sure it was. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I think it was released in 2015. The AI hasn't really changed that much. I know there is a few new bits and pieces in the AI, but nothing major. Um, so far, performance, I have 24 FPS here in the Herzilla, which isn't bad for the zoo area. Usually you'd get uh, lower frames, like maybe 10 frames lower, but I don't know. It depends on the PC, I guess. Um, my PC seems to run lower frames than most of the ones, so I'm here because I am running a 4 gigabyte patch. I never usually run that, but when I loaded in the first time, I got pretty a lot of white texture, so I said I better load in the 4 gigabyte patch just to be on the safe side. The old OMSI one poster's gone, look. The, the building there. That building's changed, but it looks, it looks different. Yeah. So coming up is our first change of the, the road layout, as you can see there to the left. Um, well, firstly the traffic lights, as you can see, we have a bus traffic light and we have a car traffic light. So um, the bus traffic light here um, is going to tell me Hello. to go over here to this middle lane avoid all this. Um, this traffic, which keeps me off the main road, I guess. Hello. And I must 
say as well, I bought this add on, I didn't get it off Halicon. I know that you should give me free stuff, but I actually bought this one. Um, I think I bought it because I was kind of a number of X10 and I wanted to just see what's changed, I guess, oh. because it's such a legendary map for obviously that. I, uh, I wanted to buy it and see the change. What do you like the change? I had a fall coming to do. Good day. speedometers up here as well to say what the speed of you should be going on this little 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 lane. Don't look this way. Why would you look at that? Okay this is weird. I was going the other way last time. It's kind of good though because you kind of avoid all the traffic, which is pretty good, you know. All them silly lines, remember the cars used to pull in, they used to pull out, they used to go here, they used to go there, and you were like, oh, what is this middle lane here? Why is it even, why is it even there, you know, when we were on this side? So this is all of our plants now. I'm assuming it is because it's the next first stop. Only leave all plants, no one else can see here. I 
I think we're actually out of main laggy part of the map now. Um, I think just further up a little bit, it gets a little bit laggy. And then you have, there's a couple of more, more parts that it gets a little bit more laggy, but it's not uh, nothing as bad as the zoo, I don't think. Tag. Corona virus. Look. Einmal normal. Everywhere. Everywhere. Hello. Hello. Good tag. Good tag. Okay, guys, let's go. I think we're pretty full now. Oh yeah, I have to wait now, don't I, for this fella to. Like to go because these are still green. I was just about to shoot right across there, but this light doesn't look like it's registered me. So, what do I do? I'll wait till it goes red, maybe. Will it go? This is just, to me, this is just wasting time. I'd like to just get across there now. But I think my junction is broke. I'll wait for a minute to see. Is that them lights red? They're green? He hasn't got lights. Oh, look, here they are now, look so. a silly baby. All I had to do was put my indicator. Because you know yourself, over all the years, how many times have the AI hit into us and cost us money or damage in the bus company simulator or advanced Omsi bus driver? So many times, you know, so I think it's great that this has kind of given you a bit more freedom. I don't know where he is, so I'm just going to hope that he doesn't hit me. Is he behind me?
games that anyway. It was always sweet up here in the net. That's supposed to be like that. <laughs> it was green for the bus, alright. Sorry guys, we're all there. 
skin the corpse. I'm, uh, I'm out of practice with the DL. Probably out of practice with most stuff. I wonder if the, the AI have changed their behavior in terms of, <clears throat> you know, crossing lanes on this road. Remember, you used to cross the lanes and the user just stop and then you used to always hit them. That was annoying. Like, that should really be a good stain. Not, not that it needs to be, because there's not much traffic on this road. If you were to, to argue, you would say it would be a good stain. I have to get my own stop here. Do I stop here? I don't think I do. There you go. Hello. Oh, yeah. Hello. Oh, yeah. Park. Like, there's not much room left. Not just loads, actually. Hello.
So we're just gonna boot down here now, really fast, to the next stop, because I think this is where, there's an Elendor Beach or something it's called, where it's a bit laggy. But not too bad. Stay here. Ja, unglaublich. Er hat da seinen Führerschein gewonnen, aber... Aber er hat da weiter weiter weiter. Zellendorf Beach. I really like this view for some reason. I don't know why though. Maybe it gives me a broader broader view of what's in front, maybe. That's not really it. Or you have their perspective of a passenger. I'm not too sure really. Hmm. Not much has changed around this area. Um, 
few little bike lanes and stuff, and uh, probably different road markings, but nothing, uh, nothing major. Up there, they would have complained, so I had to go. Alright, let's go back to the normal view. I'm gonna stop here. I'm trying to remember what stops are what, you know, it's kind of difficult. <laughs> I think in my head, I, I know, if, like, I'm kind of questioning myself at first, why not the stop up here? After that, I think it's a lot of stops until we get to. Um, I can't think of the name of it past that little round but where we always catch the end. The curves are different as well, and the stops are the brighter. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think it's all stops along this road to get to Andalusi, and then um, we cross the road in the junction there. Go over the little bridge. I think it is. I can't think of the name of the stop. Yeah, it's not that far now. I wonder if Andalusi has changed. There's bus lights here as well, though. Look. So they've added bus priority to a lot of the junctions, which is not a bad thing, but... It looks cleaner too, you know, maybe they just wanted to, to give it an update because it was a the really, kind of the very first OMSI add-on, you know, and then it kind of, kind of came out, you know. to say it was kind of one of the more popular on the add-ons you know the first big payware add-ons to come out and then people loved it and now people probably just wanted to have an update and this is the update performance wise it seems fine for me yeah the zoo was quite step stable now I know past this zoo if you go past Herzilla, going towards Herzilla, like as in down towards the Europa Center, and that was a bit lagging for me, you know, in the previous add-on, I don't know what it's like in this one, uh, so I'm not too sure what performance-wise it is, what it's like, I might try it and do a route and see. Big fan of the DLs. I think the updated DL is not as good as the, the old DL. The old DL had better brakes. Um, ticket machine I thought was better as well. Not that I'm using this ticket machine, but I think it was better. Um, this bus just doesn't feel like the old DL. It doesn't like I'm not. It just doesn't feel there's something off with it. But that's just my personal preference. The bus probably drives fine for other people. As I say, it's probably one of the best buses in on C2 of all of them. Uh, it just doesn't feel like the old one did, so, so yeah. Andre. 
my calendar. Please stand up. Not different. Ah, looks like it's just the same. Same old stuff, bikes. Straight ahead, straight ahead, go, go, go! You stay there now, Mr. Truck. Yeah, a lot of new road markings and bike lanes here as well. See if this round that I was actually changed. This has changed here as well, yeah. This is different. Looks nicer actually. Um. Yeah, you're impressed too, are you, my friend? I have a boy, I have a, a traffic light here, do I? Okay. Okay, that's weird. Why is there a traffic light here? Strange. Is it traffic management going into lift or what is it? Do I go panda? I don't know if I go on there or not. So I'm not sure what to do. It didn't give me anything to go on. Maybe I should be on it, but I don't know. Um, oh, I shouldn't be on it. Maybe come on back if you have to go on it. Wow, this this roundabout's big now. Fantastic. This was like the most the worst roundabout of all time to get around an OMC2. Because especially in the DL you'd always clip something, you know? So now it looks pretty decent. It looks pretty better. A lot better. A lot easier. Like it used to be tiny. Now it's a proper roundabout. Proper roundabout. And it looks like I have to go back through there, yeah, on the way back, which is not, not too bad. Nice, we like it, we like it. A bit more space. You got blood on your face, you bet that's Christ. Lights still take about 10 minutes to change, I wonder. too because that was never there either. It makes it look a lot nicer. Am I early later? Well I can't see everything. Oh look at that. Bang on time. That's unusual for me. See I don't know whether you guys know about the bug and obviously where you press if you press the information line. Or sorry, if you spawn a bus and then respawn that bus, the bug is that the information line disappears and you can't ever see it again. So um what you usually do is you don't know then if you're going to be early or late, you know, to a stop because you don't have their information. Right? Obviously on certain buses you can see on the ticket machine, but I can't because my ticket machine is broke. <laughs> so, so I don't know what time it is. But I can see at the time on the dash that it's 14.36. Uh, sorry mate. all changed a bit as well. It looks a lot cleaner. It looks, it looks like there's a lot more detail 
but not that much detail if that makes any sense at all. It looks it looks cleaner. You know, it looks nice. Um, it looks modern. That's the word. Missed the window. Um, it looks more modern. It doesn't look like plain, kind of like it did before. Um, so overall, it's it's not bad. Yeah. Um, is it worthy of the 12 euro purchase or 15? Probably not. Um, I would say it's probably not that worthy. If they just updated the textures and the the objects, the street objects and scenery objects to make their BRT, then maybe um, as an updated for the Berlin X10 add-on, it would have been fine a free update, you know, just just give it to the lab, the, the, the people for free, because I still think it would be more playable or more enjoyable um, if people got it for just a free update. Um, and I think a lot of people would think that um, it's a free update should be more worthy of the cause rather than paying 15 euro for a separate map um, but the same map if you can understand like there's nothing different um, there's no different routes or anything like that it's just it's just the same map just with a few different roads taken out and a few different roads put in basically and um, it just to me probably <coughs> doesn't really justify um, paying 15 euro for it and that's just my honest opinion because um, a lot of the stuff is the same and it's it's 15 euro you know? <laughs> like they haven't fixed the bus thing here with a B on it so there's some bugs that have been in the X10 that are still in this one so I mean they should really work at fixing them probably rather than kind of going at a brand new map and looking for 15 euro for it so I pay 15 euro for it, or 12 euro, sorry, which I probably shouldn't have, but I wanted just to show you guys before you was paid for it. Um, yeah. This is awkward, isn't it? Go. Oh, I'm going anyway. I'm not hanging around waiting for anyone else. Yeah, my thoughts exactly, Mrs. the end of that guys um, that was the new Berlin Rapid Transit um, Transit or Transport hang on Berlin Rapid Transit Line X10 um, new payware DLC from Halicon Media with a C2 Solo Euro 6 and a MAN DLO5 um, Please, if you've got this far in my video, let me know what you think in the comments. If you've bought it, if you think of buying it after this video, um, yeah. So, 
yeah, so let me know how you just got on, guys. And um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.